Hey South Hills, this is Moses Camacho, uh, executive pastor. Honored to be able to share with you guys uh, what we've done throughout the year. One year ago, we started this journey of giving towards beyond our walls. And we have two tracks that we focus on just to make it simple. Track number one is the first track of being obedient to God by tithing. It is that 10% that we give back to God. But here at South Hills, we don't stop there. And the reason we don't stop there is because God doesn't stop. If you've ever been given anything by God, you've noticed you've continued to be given more and more by God. So once we've learned how to give 10% and we've learned to be obedient to God by our tithing, then we step into track number two, which is the beyond our walls, which is the journey of generosity. And in this journey, we ultimately don't set a number on what God is putting on your heart. We don't set that because it's a conversation between you and God and where you ask God, God, I've been faithful with giving my 10%. I know the scripture says not to stop there. And so how would you like me to continue in this journey of generosity? How would you like me to grow? How would you like me to be more like you in giving? And what do we do at South Hills Church with generous givers? Anything that comes in to South Hills Church through Beyond Our Walls goes directly back to four specific areas. One is we plant more campuses with Beyond Our Walls in different cities and ultimately different states and ideally in other countries. And it's our heart's desire to make that happen so that the local church can continue to share the good news of Christ and bring people to God who are hurting and who are living a life without purpose and direction. And so through Beyond Our Walls, we take the giving through that and plant churches so that people can have hope, can have purpose, and can have a life with Christ. And the other thing that we do with Beyond Our Walls is we have local outreach impact with our churches. And what I mean by that is we ask all of our campuses to take a portion of their Beyond Our Walls giving and find ways to come alongside of organizations in the city that are ultimately helping people to grow in their life, to have a better quality of life, to have more safety in their life. And so we find a way to partner with the city where we as a local church can show our love to the city beyond our walls inside of our church. The third thing that we do with Beyond Our Walls is global impact. And we find ways to ultimately meet needs in the global parts of the world. As you know, we have a campus in Puerto Rico. And so South Hills Church has figured out ways to use Beyond Our Walls giving to bless families in those communities. The fourth thing that we get to do with Beyond Our Walls is our campus development. Places that you're sitting in right now getting to listen to our messages, getting to be a part of worship, to get in experienced communities. And those facilities, as you know, is a front door to the community so that people can come in and have an experience with Christ so that they can know that they're not here by accident, but they're here because God wanted them here. And that South Hills Church is a family that gets to come alongside of them and share scripture with them and share the God of love to them so that they know that they're not alone. And so those are the four things that we get to do through Beyond Our Walls. Just to name a few, here are some of the things that we've been able to do because of your giving. All this ministry and all this life change gets to happen because of you. Because of you who have been faithful in your giving. You cannot love without giving. Because when we can adopt the heart of giving, we ultimately become more and more like Christ. And so thank you. Thank you so much for being obedient to God. Thank you for being like Christ. Thank you for giving. Because of your generosity and because of your heart for God, lives are being changed in our local communities and global communities. Thank you.